claim itself is intriguing that Anonymous is targeting ISIS for revenge, but it is a tricky claim to verify. It's not like we can call ISIS and ask them how their social media is running this week. So tonight we'll take a careful look at what's happening, beginning with the video that started it all. We are tracking down members of a terrorist group responsible for these attacks. We'll not give up, we will not forgive, and we'll do all that is necessary to end their actions. Posted after the Paris attacks, the hacker group Anonymous makes the news promising to use its talents to attack a tool that has become very valuable to ISIS, the internet. A day later, another version comes in French bearing the same threat. Yeah. Vendredi 13 novembre 2015, notre pays. Generally translated as expect massive cyber attacks, war is declared. And now, just days later, news is spreading that hundreds, if not thousands, of social media accounts linked to ISIS were published by Anonymous, and that Twitter has suspended a number of those accounts. While this is going on, some high profile hacktivists, including the Jester and Discordian, cast doubt on the claims. But an account believed to be associated with ISIS on the messaging platform called Telegram instructs followers to change their IP addresses, amongst other steps to take. Cyber expert Paul Oster says only time will tell if this anonymous threat is real, but he is hopeful. The very nature of the beast of anonymous is you're not going to sort through who's actually providing this information and verification is going to be very difficult uh, to say the least. Like it or not, they're, they're more, they have better tools than our governments. This is modern warfare and there's nobody better to lead this charge than Anonymous. Time will tell if this is in fact real. If it is, it represents an escalation from the beginning of the year when Anonymous made threats after the Charlie Hebdo attack. According to a report published in Foreign Affairs, 149 ISIS websites were dismantled as a result of Anonymous there. Arthur Chian, Fox 5 News. Thank you.